about to experience the awe and the mystery which reaches from the inner mind. Hey, welcome back everybody. This is Rusek Hulu here in Tokyo and I just wanted to show you this this weekend I've been working on this thing. I got the new uh, PCB boards and they're already here as you can see. They're really nice. I managed to put uh, the processor and LEDs and everything over here to make the trigger, the Bluetooth on the back. And now I'm just gonna put, I, I went for the design from the battery so it's uh, cheaper for you guys maybe. I still don't know the price, but um, I'm gonna make some calculations and the stuff that I saved and whatever, so I can probably set up a price. Um, this is what I have so far for the connector to the camera. As you can see, it's not like the beautiful, most beautiful professional thing. It's really, really homemade. Uh, I'm thinking to put like a 3D print something here, maybe, I don't know. But uh, yeah, I'll figure that one out. I just wanted to make sure that it works. So I'm gonna go ahead and put the two batteries here and see if that will just make it work. As far as the batteries go, I'm using this year 2032. They're really easy to find, they're really cheap. I think they cost me like $2 or whatever and they're sunny. So yeah, you can probably find this CR2032 anywhere they want. So they're pretty common. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this guys in the device and, and check it out. So as you can see, there is one battery inside over here already. And if I switch this thing on, you can see the Bluetooth is actually searching already and it's fine with just one battery. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and connect it with a separate device. And as you can see, there is the light over here. So it's not that strong, but it will work. I'm gonna send just a, a trigger message, a simple trigger message, maybe here. There you go. So you can see it, it does the trick, it does work in here. And uh, this battery is 3 volts, so it will start draining down and it will start to come 2.9, 2.8 or whatever and it starts to drop a lot. And this module over here to put the batteries, you can put an extra one, this is also a new one. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn it off and you can just like, like slide it up like this. and put two batteries like that. So that would be six volts. So the device is already ready for that. It's it's fine. The only thing that it will do is probably make the LEDs more bright. <laughs> so you turn it on, there it is searching and you connect with the Bluetooth. And now you can see it's way brighter than it was before. And if I send the trigger signal, um, here we go. There you go. So that's in the trigger. If you want to do a B mode, a uh, bulb mode, then you can just like keep it on like that and then turn it off when you want to finish your exposure. So let's go ahead and go to the camera. All right, so here we are with the camera. I'm just putting in a little more bright spot. And as you can see, here's the trigger, the connector, and there's a hot shoe. So I'm just going to connect it on the bottom over here to the camera. There's a uh, some uh well the rc67 pro 2 at least it has this uh electromagnetic connector in front so i'm just gonna swipe it on and as you can see it has a, a direction so you can put it backwards so there we go it's pointing this way and now it's connected so i'm gonna turn it on and it's just right now set to 400 and m so it, it will it will trigger you see i'm gonna go ahead and trigger manually and as you can see, there is uh, uh, the, the winder that works in. So I'm gonna go ahead and try to trigger it without touching it. So <laughs> there we go. So I'm gonna turn this on. It's already on, it's searching. It has two batteries right now. So I'm gonna connect with an external device. And as you can see, it, the, one of the lights turns on. And I'm just gonna send a normal trigger, a trigger signal. If I want to set a B mode, then I will come over here and put it on the B right there. I can set a constant push right here. The exposure right now is being taken and I can stop the exposure. And as you can see, I, I've worked with the B mode right now. So yeah, I can do it manually or I can do it time it or whatever. That's going to be on the app that I'm working on. But yeah, you can send just a uh, just a signal to trigger or, you know, start a B mode or stop a B mode. So yeah, you can put it like, I don't know, like two seconds over here, you focus your camera and then you send a trigger signal. 
and as you see it was automatically two seconds so if you want to be mode you put it on be mode again and just start the exposure one two three four whatever you want you can stop the exposure and as you can see this guy will actually let you know that it's it that it's exposing over here and that's that would be pretty much uh, don't worry for this sign it's just a sticker that i put in the camera uh, so I was thinking to put this guy over here maybe with a lo like a hot shoe but some of you guys use a trigger that you connect over here so I don't want to bother that part so I was thinking maybe like I don't know like some kind of like velcro tape over here or something and that way it would not avo it would not um, bother you with putting uh, anything else I don't know how fat it's going to become with the case and maybe it's going to maybe five six millimeters is gonna be bigger than this because of the pattern in the front part i can leave it open if you if you guys don't mind <laughs> if you guys don't mind yeah i mean i can send it to you and you guys can do your own cases if you want to um power wise yeah it's three to six volts as you can see over here it's probably draining the batteries right now but um these are two new batteries i'm just gonna leave it um on and connect it for a while and until check how much time these two batteries would last and yeah it seems pretty strong right now the signal and the light is pretty strong so yeah there here it is it's the first one that I, that I made it's really simple and it's just meant for for triggering the camera I was gonna put all of these screens and speakers and stuff but uh, a lot of you guys said that you don't need that much so it's just the trigger so yeah pretty simple thing I'm just gonna trigger and that's how it works let me know what you guys think and uh, yeah send me some comments or whatever and uh, I'm not sure when I can start taking orders I'm gonna go ahead and try to finish the app first and then I can show you it working with the app and then try to upload it to the App Store because uh, if I send it to you uh, you guys can use it but it will be really 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 manual so if I can put an app on the App Store that would be great I still have some a few things to figure it out, but I'll be figuring it out as you can see the, the This thing is already working. It's, it's a nice evolution already. It's a nice advance. So thank you guys for watching and uh, See you soon and I look forward to see your comments. Bye. Bye